Colombia es muy importante para la continente de América del Sur. Recientemente, la país tiene una transformación. Muchas ciudades y playas muestran la histórica con bonita y bebida arquitectura y con muchas actividades en la ciudad. Las personas aman cam caminar y hacer turismo. Okay. Uh, Bogotá es la capital de Colombia. La Candelaria. Candelaria is the historic downtown of Bogota. It holds the top museums, government buildings, and colonial buildings. Almost all of the traditional attractions are here. The center of Candelaria is the Simón Bolivar Plaza. This area holds most of the government buildings. A statue is dedicated to Simón Bolivar, the man who won independence for Colombia by defeating the Spanish army. Mendelín was once a city of hate and crime with many drug cartels in the area. It has now become a wonderful city full of industry and commerce. It was voted the world's most innovative city in 2012. Mendelín was nicknamed the city of eternal spring because of its pleasant climate. But the weather isn't the only great thing about the city. It has many education institutions, museums, and art galleries. A few hours outside of Mendelín lies Piedra del Menú del Pinol, which is frankly a 10 million ton rock. 650 steps, once made out of wood, lead to the top of the rock. At the top, souvenirs and drinks are available for sale. The view consists of lake valleys and mountains. The rock has a giant letter G and an incomplete U on the side. The town of Guatape claimed the rock is theirs, despite the residents in the nearby El Pinol, who already had claimed the rock as their own and began to paint their town's name. A giant mob formed and quickly put an end to the attempt of ownership. Today, Piedra, Piedra del Pinol supposedly belongs to a family in the area, although Colombia has declared it a national monument. Along the Caribbean near Santa Marta lies a wonderful national park. The Tyrona National Park holds amazing treasures. Long ago, the Tyrona tribe inhabited the area and to this day their descendants live there at El Pueblito. Outdoor beds and hammock huts are provided to enjoy the views of the open sky. The sites under the water are available if you choose to swim or snorkel at the site. <laughs>